welcome back to my channel so if you guys are new my name is Kristen and I'm kind of slightly addicted to everything in the Sims 4 here on my channel but in today's video we are actually going to be giving Eliza pancakes a complete head-to-toe makeover and poor Bob he's gonna be left out because I don't really have any mail custom content right now I'm probably gonna be spending the weekend looking for some and I know you guys have heard me say that before but I honestly am so picky when it comes to mail um, custom content that when I actually go shopping for mail custom content it's like four pieces after like two hours of looking so I kind of got to spend a little bit more time and work on that so if you guys like anything that you see that I did with Eliza and maybe you want to download it for yourself I will make sure to do my absolute best to leave all of the links down in the description and in case I accidentally miss anything definitely check out my tumblr I reblog everything there that I ever put into my game so um, that link is down in the description as well it's just under Kristen Marie XO and um, I know that I did use the um, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's like Kyo Coco eyelashes. I use those pretty much on every single sim. I only have those eyelashes. And I use the Apricot Skin Overlay because that's kind of one of the newest ones that I've downloaded. So it's kind of currently my favorite right now. I really love how it just kind of like evens out the skin, like really makes it like matte looking. And um, the hair that I used was pretty similar um, it's the exact same hair actually as I used for the plant sim however when you actually download this hair you get two options one is for like um, like the solid color that I used on Eliza and then the plant sim was more of like the ombre effect so that's pretty cool that you get like your two different options because um, ombre is still kind of popular um, or trendy um, I still really like it so it was nice to have like two different options and another thing with Eliza being a redhead I didn't really realize I don't really make that many redheads with like creative sims and um, it just kind of got me to look at all of the different like cu um, custom content hair that I have in like the red tones so that was pretty cool a lot of like different color options that I didn't really notice before that kind of like blended with blonde and things like that so I really hope that you guys like how she turned out she was definitely hands down one of the most requested townie makeovers in the last few um, of these videos that I have actually posted so definitely let me know down in the comments I love reading all of your guys's suggestions and let me know which townie would you guys like to see me give a makeover to next um, and definitely check out the playlist I have started so this is only in the beginning of the series here on my channel so there's um Eliza is the third in the series and it's definitely a video that I will be putting up once a week here on my channel for a townie makeover so definitely consider subscribing if you do like watching these kind of videos and I also put up lots of builds and um once in a while I'll do a let's play still kind of new to let's play so um, they're not really as often as they probably should be but thank you guys so much for watching and if you guys do like how she turned out make sure to give this video a very big thumbs up that way that I know that you guys did enjoy and also definitely consider subscribing here to my channel and hopefully I will get to see you guys in my next video bye guys